What is up, YouTube? It is me, Crazy White Boy 0605, also known as Oak Blur, and I'm just listening to worship music uh, because I am going to preach to you guys one of my favorite verses. By the way, the name of the song in the background is Our God by Chris Tomlin. So, uh, Chris Tomlin, I really do like him a lot. So, here we go. <clears throat> I want you guys to turn to Acts chapter. Hold on a second. There we go. Acts chapter 1, verse 1 through 7. <clears throat> and it says, Jesus taken up into heaven. That's the name of the thing. Okay. Chapter 1, verse 1. In my former book, Theophilus, I wrote a part about all Jesus. Of that Jesus began to do to teach until the day he was taken up to heaven after giving instructions to the Holy Spirit of the Apostles he had chosen after his suffering he showed himself to these men and gave many convincing proofs that he was alive he appeared to them over a period of 40 days and spoke about the kingdom of God on one occasion while well, he was eating with them, he gave them this command. Do not leave Jerusalem, but wait for the gift of my when the father that promised. Of my father promised. Okay. Uh, yeah, for other promise when you have heard me speak about. For John baptized with water, but in a few days you will be baptized with the Holy Spirit. I just... So when they met together, they asked him, Lord, are you at this time going to restore the kingdom of Israel? He said to them, It is not for you to know the times or dates the Father has set, but by his own authority. That was Acts chapter 1, verse 1 through 7. And you guys can look it up for all you want. Uh, I'm going to talk about this music playing. Uh, the Aldridge County guys pretty much, it's pretty much saying, okay, quit. people are saying that Jesus is coming back, or was supposed to come back 12-21-12. Well, it didn't happen. Because people are predicting when things are going to happen. And, it, and I just read it right here, the uh, last two verses, it says, and the, do not predict the time or dates. Only Jesus knows when it's time to come, when he's coming back. And on verse, I believe it was 6, it said, You will be baptized by the Holy Spirit. What it means by that is you'll feel his presence all over you, and you'll speak in tongues, you'll be crazy, you'll laugh, you'll cry, you'll, you'll be just emotional, and you'll shake, but mainly speak in tongues. And it's pretty much saying, oh, by the way, you'll get goosebumps too. So, I just want to let you guys know that God is coming back soon. He will be here sooner than you think. All we gotta do is keep worshiping Jesus Christ. He'll be coming back really soon. As the saying, God is stronger than us in this song. God is stronger. He is smarter than us. He is healer. And he is awesome in power. Um, the only reason why I want... I'm gonna start doing these once in a while. Bible verse and preach with music in the background. Uh, next Tuesday, I'll probably do this like I did today. But I just want to let you guys know, I love you guys, you know, I mean, Jesus is the healer. Um, I just want to say that he is coming, like I said. That was my first time preaching in front of you guys. Uh, and I just, like I said, I just want to say that I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching this video. The song, I believe, is about over. Yeah, it's almost over. I'll let you guys listen to the music. I'll talk some more. Uh, my youth group is doing this thing coming up in February 15th and 16th. It's called Acquired Fire. And what Acquired Fire is, is pretty much a ministry that every, a lot of churches, probably about a thousand churches, come, come to Atlanta from all over the state. Um, they have skits. They have <clears throat> dramas. They have bands. 
many worship bands. They have a Christian comedian. His name is John Gray. Great guy. <laughs> he gave us a shout out uh, last couple years. Every year we've been going, he's been giving us a shout out. And I am stoked for it. I can't wait for a choir to fire. Uh, to, uh, Saturday night, I am going to see, for today, Gideon, Upon a Burning Body, uh, look, the Memphis May Fire, and The Word Alive. And, yeah. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Read the Bible. I recommend Acts. Because Acts is a really good Bible, ver Bible chapter. It's pretty much talking about the end of times. So, enjoy that verse. I mean, thank you guys for watching this video. Until my next video, I'll see you guys when I see you guys, which is next Tuesday. Have a great weekend. I'm praying for you guys. Peace.